more footage from Muhammad Ali's training camp from what he called Fighter's Heaven in Deer Lake, Pennsylvania. Uh, these are clips from Ali's sparring sessions prior to taking on Larry Holmes in 1980. Uh, the first fighter he's sparring here is Marty Monroe. Monroe was a ranked heavyweight during this time, and even though he was uh, undersized for the division, uh, he did have some power. Uh, he knocked out Eddie Lopez and Lynn Ball, who were fringe contenders at the time, uh, but Monroe would later be stopped by Greg Page in five rounds, which uh, pretty much ended his run as a contender. He was a pretty decent heavyweight, and he cuts Ali's nose in a later sparring session that they had. Uh, the second fighter in the workout here is Jody Ballard. Now, Ballard was a durable journeyman, but uh, mostly known for serving as a sparring partner for Ali and Holmes, as well as being pounded on by George Foreman in an exhibition. Now, the third fighter you'll see here is the mystery sparring partner. Uh, I can assume that he was trained by Jimmy Ellis, as Ellis can be seen standing in his corner when he enters the ring against uh, Ali. Uh, the mystery sparring partner here is tall, he has good movements, and his punches flow well. Um, but I can't identify him. Uh, some of you offered some good guesses. Uh, he's not Leroy Caldwell or, or Big Roy Williams, and definitely not Shonuff from The Last Dragon, as so many of you have suggested in my comment page. I thought it could be Von Zell Johnson, a light heavyweight that was training under Angelo Dundee, but it's not him facially. This is either a guy named uh, Mike Dawson or Maine Miller, uh, which are two fighters that were sparring with Ali during this time period that I don't have any visuals on, or it could be somebody completely different. Uh, so for now, his identity uh, remains a mystery. Uh, nonetheless, Ali is at center stage here as he struggles to uh, spar his way back into shape. So this is footage as rare as rare can be, and I hope you enjoy. Mm -hmm. 